Welcome back to the Legend of Heroes Trails in the Sky. Security clearance. That's right, we're about to get it. The horrible droid weapons. Interesting. Patrol unit, the scout unit, the port seeker, and the combat unit vanguard. I didn't mean to do that. Well, we've got all the infos now. Too bad Grant couldn't be here to sh share that sweet info with us. Can't yeah, sneak past him. Ah! No! That's highly irregular. Okay, we're getting out of here. No thanks. Actually, you know what? That's dumb. There's a save point right here. By save point, I mean charging point. Why do I need to heal? There's no reason. Here is a red clearance. But I don't remember if there were any other... Oh. You know what? I don't want to be here yet. I want to check to see if there are any other red clearances around this floor because I need other card keys too. And my working theory is that the other card keys will be found in the door that opens from the red card key. Like this one. Hey, it's our friend! I really want to pilot this thing. You know, a house of horror for one person is a toy factory for somebody else. Nope, can't get into it. Green, I don't think I have. Yeah, I don't, yeah, I don't have cataract access to, to green yet. Do I? Did I miss a terminal somewhere? Let's check. I feel like I'm meant to get into those rooms at some point. By the way, really enjoy the music in this place, especially the, the sick bass lines. Bass lines, bass lines, somebody can yell at me right at this instant. Okay, so we need a blue card and a green card. That way we can work legally in the United States. I don't think there's any other place for us to go except for going up this elevator, which I guess we'll do. But, reminder to self, if I ever find those other colors, I should come back. I don't have green. I wonder when we're going to see some of the other robot models, because these guys are getting boring to fight. Savor the victory. We earned it. You could say, well, why don't you just not fight him? I can't do that. I'm here to clean out. Drain the swamp, if you will.
Night goggles. I think I've gotten one of those before. Uh, it lets you see in the dark. I think. Wait a minute. How come I never equip this? Prevent, seal, and mute. That's a lot better than the Petrify, because I don't think Petrify is that common, really. Mute is much more damaging to Estelle than... Well, Petrify is a lot more damaging, but... I feel like Petrifying enemies are much more telegraphed. It's a nice looking place. Can I sleep here? Nope. Hey, where did that robot come from? I find it odd that there's one pod that's open. I wonder who that pod belongs to. Uh, nowhere else for us to go except for this way. Green, we don't have. Oh, thanks. Should have seen it coming. Hey, we give you this pair of glasses which allows you to see in the dark. Why don't you not equip it? I don't know. Probably not useful. Slowly inching ahead. Um, one second. That's a dead end. Are there even enemies here? That's a dead end. Dead end. Let me go this way first. I can go into that room. And let's see if there are any other rooms for us to go into before we commit. It's very important to scout out your surroundings. That's another room. What is this? Nothing. I can't see the color differences. Hold on. I think I know what to do. Now if I take that off, maybe I can see the colors. It's blue. Alright, we don't have that yet. Where can I find a set of blue keys? Not the right button at all. So let's go to this one first, because that's hidden out of the way, so I assume that's a secret room. Yeah. A golden colored chest. Though, I am afraid nobody can take advantage of this. Okay. Goes from 43 to 33. You know what? We have enough pair of those ebony shoes. That seems like a dangerous looking door. Oh hey, it's Karna! I don't remember her being too bad, except that she has AoE attacks, which can be very, very annoying. Now, the question, I think, let's do this first. I don't want to touch the robot until they move, because they call reinforcements, so I want to have the ability to wipe them out in one step.
It's not great. Everybody else doesn't matter because they're all art users, but having Zayn far, far away from the action is not preferable, to say the least. I don't think I can get two of them, can I? I can't. Then let's go for it. And we'll punch you back further into the machine just to make sure. Not so tough now, are you? She's very fast. And that's annoying me a little bit. I don't like people when people are fast. Okay. Can I... I think I should be able to get something in before... Yeah. That should do it. You can't stop spinning now. A little bit tempted to just go ahead and not even bother healing, but you know, everybody has to fence down, so it wouldn't do. Now she has attack up. I'm tempted to try how much damage this will do. Pretty good. I'm impressed. Somehow, I get a feeling that Karna is one of those style over substance people. Right, let's not get too cocky here. Still, still deserve some respect even though we beat her three times now. Three times? Well, four times. I forget. There's ones in the martial arts tournament. There's ones that where she was pretending to be like a, like a Jaeger lady. And maybe that's it. I don't remember. What am I doing? Okay. We need to fire up some arts. In some level, I feel like so far, every fight in here, the trick has been the movement because all the enemies tend to move around a lot. So if all of my attackers are physical attackers, then we may have problems reaching them. Now, since my party is basically all art users, except for Zhang, who has a huge amount of movement because I gave him those boots, we're actually doing quite well. Is that a cancel? Yes. That's fine. I don't mind. Waste your turn on a cancel. Well, you're almost dead. True on this. not get carried away. Alright, you're nothing. Where does this, where does all those rocks come from? One has to wonder. Ouroboros needs to do some uh, let's say some ceiling work. I don't know, Estelle. You did quite fine. How do you know what it feels like to be run over by an airship? That's always, always the important question. You know, when somebody goes and uses some super exaggerated uh, metaphor. Metaphor? Or is that a simile? I don't remember. I think that's a simile. That feels like eating soap. Well, how do you know what eating soap is like? Maybe it's actually quite delicious. We have not.
It's obviously a trap. I mean, how obvious can it get? They sent one guy out to the shore, like, Hey, why don't you guys come over here? Let's have a party. And then they put one of these people on every single floor. And they give us this nice elevator music. But that's okay. Because what they don't know is that we have a secret weapon for traps. It's called the power of friendship. The chain of command obedience program. That sounds like something fun. I wanna I wanna take that program. Protection of secrecy hypnosis program. Got the green card. Perfect. Now we can go back downstairs and open all the green doors we missed. Thanks for watching. See you next time.